Hi, so welcome to Tantulous Oracle. So what I'm going to do today is a little bit different. I'm just going to try to go over a few cases. And where I'm at, I'm going to be on here on Black and Missing on Facebook. And I'm just going to go down the line. So we're going to start off with uh, Yotis Harris. And what I'm going to do is just try to give an overview of what's going on with those cases. So, um, like I said, I, I'm just going to go through, I don't know who's on there or what's, just whoever comes up next. If I've already done the case, um, I'm not going to do it again. Or if the person has been found alive, I'm not going to do it. But if they have been found deceased, I'll do it. So, like I said, we're going to start off with Eotis Harris. And he... Is 32 years old and he is missing from Fort Worth, Texas since June 16th of this year. And it says his two dogs were found dead where he was last seen, but his last location was leaving his apartments with his two dogs in his truck, a 2020 BM GMC truck. And his luggage was found in Hudaka, Texas, on the side of the road, and his truck was found in Aspermont, Texas. So, I want to look into what's going on with Eotis Harris III. And I'm just going to be using these cards today. So, Eotis Harris III. All right, is he missing? What happened? So we have this house. Now this can be his home or um, somebody else's home. And then at the bottom we have change. So this could be him changing homes, going to stay at another home. But this is also your surroundings. So this is a change of surroundings here of your foundation, your home base. Okay. Here you have somebody who has some concerns over something that they were um, going to do to help somebody. So they're, they're concerned about something. So it's like you doing something. It's like, oh, I wonder if that's a good idea. Or I wonder if, you know, it's kind of like that type of concern over something you, you are doing to help someone. So maybe someone else could have been changing homes. And he was doing them a favor, maybe going to help them or something like that. But there's some concern over something he's doing to help someone. Here, this is an obligation, something that you have to do that you really don't want to do. Um... Nerves, but anyway, it's something that you don't want to do or you're obligated to do, okay. And then this here is a message, so he could have received a phone call, an email, a text, or something right here concerning something that he it's like he wanted to like he's going to help somebody, but he's like, Oh, I really don't want to do it or whatever. But I already told him that I would do I was doing it, okay. But then he got some type of message. What is the message about? Okay, so we have this official person. So this is something that has come up that you have no control over. Okay, so something he doesn't have any control over concerning another male. Okay, because this could be a businessman. This could be somebody with money. This could be uh, just some, some male here that is like a, a business partner or just another male in general. This person is successful in some way. Okay. What else is going on? Okay, that's changes. Saw that child card tried to come out. That's change, uh, new beginnings, or innocence, or just a child. Okay. What else is going? On? 
Okay, so this is here. Somebody is leading you down a pathway. So it's kind of like um, the things that you have to go through your journey or your path. Okay. Or this could be a street. So this could be something connected to this main male could be Yotis. He was going down this path or he was going down this road. Okay. So he was traveling down this road or this could be somebody leading him down into a wooded area as well. And here you have the lovers here. See, courtship and lovers. So this is him meeting up with someone new or having a meeting with someone. So this is him. You have this lovers. He was meeting up with someone he was in a relationship with. So I don't know if he was moving to this other person because he said he had luggage. So was he moving there? Was he going for a short visit? What was, was he going down there to help them with something? Whoever this was. Okay, because he was meeting up with someone he had a relationship with. Here you have sudden wealth and a false person. So this is um this could be a false sudden wealth. So it's not things are not what they seem. But also sudden wealth is mean it this means that someone is going to give you something that you don't have to work for. So that means somebody could be giving you money. Oh, just come down here. It's not like you're working for like a job, but this is something that you've been you're you are being given. So it could be him helping somebody else out. It doesn't have to be money monetarily. It could just be in doing something for you. But this is coming from a false person or someone who is not truthful here or not who they claim to be. And here you have a mature woman here that he was doing something for. So like I said, this could have been a, a person he was in a relationship with okay he was going to meet them somewhere i don't know where he was going does it say but he was going to meet this person somewhere at a house but there was some concern over some things that he was supposed to do but then then something happened he had no control or this could be an actual official person this could be an outside person in the relationship that he had with this with this person here but whatever happened, it was something that he had no control over. Somebody was take like somebody is doing things against your will. You have no control over what happens in this situation because this person has taken over, overpowering you in some way. Okay, what else do we need to know? Okay, we have a thief and a message, okay? So, he received some information about something being taken or somebody received, either him or whoever is involved received some information about something being taken. What was taken? Now, it could have been something taken or a message about something not being as much as it was so he could have got a a message about whatever this relationship he had with this person not being um like somebody is not in, as into it as he is so that could have been the message that something is less than what it is like it's not that serious with me it may be that serious with you but it's not that serious with me type of thing okay so what was the message between Okay, this long journey, this big journey. So this is like his journey was cut short. So whatever happened on the way 
to where he was going, it was cut short in some type of way. Something happened on this trip, on the way, wherever he was going, something happened on his path there to meet this person. What happened? This is wealthy man coming back out again. So it's a male involved in here. So it's a female and another male involved with his disappearance connected to this relationship he had with this woman here. So if anybody know about his case, you could put it in the comment section. And now I'm going to go to the next one that I see. Okay, so the next one is, what's his name? LaDante. Ely. Okay, so we have LaDante Ely, and he is his. He has been found, but he went missing on September third of this year. But he was his body was found in the Effingham County River, um, and his case is being investigated as a homicide. But he is missing from Granite City, Illinois, since September third. Um, he was last seen in Granite City on September 3rd, and according to his family, he is suffering from a mental health breakdown. So let's see what was going on with LaDante Ely. What happened to LaDante Ely? Okay, we have the courthouse and a pathway. So there was some, now courthouse means that there are some legal issues, but it's not extreme. It could be like um, just minor legal things or um, things that you have to do on your day-to-day -day basis. Okay, so some things like that on his path, but it's also um, how you're being looked at or how you're being seen here and you know, on your path. And this is connected to a marriage and he, there's some thoughts here. So this, I know he's not married. If he is, I don't know. But this is right here relating to a marriage. So this could be a couple here that he is in his thoughts. Okay. So let's see what that is about. So you have this mature woman here being locked away so maybe he could have been involved with an older married woman maybe this woman told him that she has some issues going on in her marriages which is like some things that's keeping her from leaving uh, some legal things or maybe she doesn't know how she'll be looked at if she's uh, if she leaves her husband to be with him or or whatever something along those lines Not sure his relationship status because it doesn't say any of that, so I don't know. Here you have a death or an ending. Here is official, so this death could be related because he felt like there were some things that he had no control over and he could not change. So he decided to do this. I don't know if he did it or if it was, they said it's a homicide. So this death could have been out of his control. Like somebody killed him relating to this woman that was married, this married woman that was, that he was, could have been in a relationship with. Okay. What else is going on here? All right, you have somebody in despair and great fortune. So you're, it's like, oh, I don't have any luck in what I'm doing. Okay, because you're great fortunate. There's some despair with it. So it's like 
things are not working out in your favor here. And now this could be related, like I said, relating to this married woman that he's dealing with and maybe he wants to be with her or whatever, but she, as we saw the prison card, she cannot leave for whatever the situation may be because of some legal things that's going on that maybe it will hurt her uh, legally or she, you know, there's some assets or whatever that she doesn't want, she don't want to lose if she separate from her husband. Now you have this wealthy man here in this marriage. So like I say, this woman could be married to someone who has money and she doesn't want to leave because it would hurt her in her, in her lifestyle. Like she don't mind talking to you on the side, but as far as being with you full time, no, because in this marriage, she's, this man has the money. She's not going anywhere. See this, this married man is taking control over this. He's like, there's nothing he can do about that situation in this marriage because this lady is not leaving that man. Or this wealthy man came in and took over. Maybe he found out about it. We got this false person here with this mature woman also. So this lady is, she's not who she is seems to be she's not who he she she is not who he thought she was okay and here you have this false person in this journey so this is you going back and forth leaving a situation okay so maybe she lied and told him that she was leaving her husband and, and she did not leave like i said she doesn't want to leave because this person has money and she's not giving that up so he could have been depressed about that Okay, so you have the bad health card with this coffin. So this bad health could be mental issues or, or whatever, or things are not going well. You're suffering in some type of way here in your death. There's some obligations, some things that you are obligated to do, don't want to do or whatever. So this is connected to like this relationship has put him in a bad state and also led to his death as well. Let's see what else is going on. Things ended badly here. What else do we have? This thoughts again. So, so this woman probably wasn't thinking about him anymore. Okay. I'm not leaving my man to be with you. This man has money. I, I like my lifestyle just the way it is. The husband could have found out. Things went bad. Okay. So somebody is doing something for somebody in this house. There's some giving and receiving here. So something happened in this house here. So we have something going on in this house. Somebody leading somebody down the path here. Leading someone on here, that is his job. So, and somebody's doing something for a job for someone. Okay. So this could be, he probably could have went to this lady's house. Something happened. This husband could have found out what was going on. And this led him down a path here. So I'm not sure if this is somebody killing him or is it just him. Um going into the river because he couldn't deal with what he was dealing with okay something he enjoyed okay so this person he enjoyed spending time with this person this lady and he probably wanted more than what she was willing to give him but she wasn't leaving her husband for him. okay so that is uh ladante ely so let's see who's next okay so now we have, what's this? This is, already did this. This is the baby Jacqueline Dobbs. I already did her already. So, Let's see who's next. Um, 
Jashaya Moore, I've done her. This baby has been found saved. This is um, Blaze, Blaze Barnett. Okay, so now we have Wayne Clay. Got Wayne Clay. So we have 65-year-old Wayne Clay was last seen on October 26th. Leaving the barbershop located, where is he from? from? Texas as well. Okay, so he got into a truck. His truck is missing. Also, they say he may be in need of medical attention. Okay, so. Okay, that's all they say. Okay, so we're going to look into Wayne Clay. So what happened with Wayne Clay? We have a thief here a false person so somebody is a thief somebody is not who they said so it could have been somebody he know and he doesn't realize this but this person is a thief You have this official person in this poverty. Okay. So this person, whoever this thief is, things are not going well for them. So maybe they could have used him for money or something. Not sure. Let's see. But this is just saying that's just who that person is. Okay. Whoever this person he's dealing with. False person, great fortune. Okay. So once again, whatever this, this is just your luck, bad luck dealing with this person here. Because you think this is something that is great good for you, a person that's good for you, and it's actually not because that, that fortune you think you have is not true. So that good thing or good person you think you've met, that person is not who you think they are. Here you have this child, okay? And then you have this endings or death, okay? But this child is not necessarily a child per se. This is innocence or innocent person. This could be a start, something that you're starting a new, a new beginning here, an ending. So like I said, he met someone. He thought this person was a good person for him, but this person is not who he thought they were. They're not as good as he thought they were here. Because this is something, this probably is someone new that he started out with, okay? And that led to this here. This ending or this death. All right. What else is going on here? Okay, so this is you doing something for someone. This is female. So like I said, some woman. He was helping her. Or maybe she gave him a call. Hey, can you come help me or whatever? But he was doing something to help her. Or they were sharing, spending time together. Or but see, he was doing something to help her, but she was taking from him. Or she wasn't giving him as much as he was giving it to her. So maybe this person felt like they were obligated. Okay, so if you care about me, you should do this. And now you feel like obligated here. And now you feel like you have no choice but to, to do these things for this person that you really don't want to do because they say so or, or whatever the situation may be but it's like you're being trapped into doing things for somebody that you really don't want to do and or you feel obligated to do some things 
that's why you're doing it doing it for this person helping this person out because you feel obligated to do so so this is an older woman so he he probably thought oh I met this older woman she's it's a good woman here now you have here courthouse so maybe he he was coming to help her with some little minor little um legal things here or whatever the case may be oh can you come down here i need to pay my property tax can you come down here i need to get my tag can you come down here i need to go pay this fine whatever it is that uh he was meeting up with her for or this could be how he how he viewed this woman as somebody that was good for him as well. Like I said, he enjoyed spending time with this woman. This woman led him down this road, okay? This is him traveling, just leading, going down this path here with this woman, somebody he enjoyed spending time with. This is somebody that was he had newly met. This is not an old relationship. This is somebody he had probably just recently met, okay? They were going down. He maybe had thought this person was good for him because maybe he was thinking about marrying this person, spending, going, like spending time with this person. See? getting married with this person going off into the future with this person so this is somebody he had a new relationship where he was really into this person because he was probably thinking about just being with this person here and like for the long term but this is not what that person had in mind at all this person is a thief and it's a false person this older woman he thought was great for him end up not being who she said she was okay so that is Wayne Clay who is this so now we have okay we'll see him next now we have John Dubose Jr. and let me see what they start telling so John Dubose 20 year old him and his friend the Dexter okay they flight landed November 4th no one has heard from them since then oh, wait a minute it has been reported that the unidentified friend who picked them him and the Dexter from the airport is also missing along with his vehicle, a newer model Yukon. Cell phone belonging to John was found in a wooded area. Okay, so this is John Du Bois Jr. and him and his friend is missing after going on, on a taking a flight to California. Where? Gridley, California. Okay. So let's see what's going on with John Dubois Jr. Okay, what's going on with John Dubois Jr.? Okay, sudden wealth. So this is you um, coming into some money that you didn't have to work for. But here you have this. So somebody is connecting you to some money. So this is like a middleman here, connecting him with another person or mediating some things between him and another person about this money here. So you have a third party uh, connecting him with someone that's going to help him get some money that he doesn't have to work for or helping him in some type of way. Okay. Connecting. Con the connect. Okay, so now you have this lovers change. Okay, 
So this lovers, this could be a relationship, but it also is a partnership as well. So it's not that you in love with this person you are dating, but this is you working in partnership with someone's kind of like a marriage as well. But this could also be the lovers as a relationship. So there was a change here with this lovers. So this could be a female that, like I said, was mediating with him, somebody he knew in a relationship, sexual relationship, don't have to necessarily be dating. Okay, but there was a change here with this. So this person was to connect to help him with this. The sudden wealth. Okay, so now you have this thief in this meeting. So this is him meeting up with someone and someone stole something from him, took something from him here in this meeting. So whoever he went to go meet, they took something from him. Okay, so now you have this official person here. And you have this. This is your hopes and dreams, desires. It is so something out of your control. So this is some things here that's out of your control as far as what you want to happen or what you want to do. This is you traveling a long distance here. But whatever happened here is out of your control. And you're, like when you travel this place, whatever happened was out of your control, out of your hands. Or it could be like police as well. Officials, police, military, whatever. Okay, so what else is going on here? So there was some despair here. Some things that, so things went bad. Okay. Things didn't work out as you planned when he went out here. Things went bad. Okay. Because we already see something was taken from them. So things went bad out here on this in this meeting. See, once again, things went bad. So now you have this main male. So is he the main male or this is the main male that was in the connect? Okay. So things went bad with this main male here. So that's him. Okay, so now you have this partner here, worry, message of concern. So this is like a marriage. Like I said, it's kind of like the lover's card as well. This is a partnership as well. However, there's some concern. People are worried about these two people, this partner, these two, him and his friend. People are concerned and worried about them. So people know what they went out there for. They may not be saying it, but they do. See, the community. This is family, a previous lady. So like I said, it's a female involved here. This is someone in his group who he knows, somebody in his community, his friends, his family, whatever. But this is a female involved in here on connected to his trip and this meeting okay so a female is involved in his journey so his flight over there and, and connected him like i said it was a connect this female was a connect in this meeting that and that he went out there for what else is going on Okay, so things went bad here, okay? This court card means like people, um, how they see you, how they judge you. So they had already planned to let things go bad for them anyway. So it whatever they went out for, it wasn't going to be what they thought it was anyway. 
I was already playing. Okay. Concern here at this house. Okay. So they, there are people already out there at back home worried about him because see, like I said, people already knew what they went out there for. This is why it's this quick concern about them. They're back home concerned about what happened. Okay. Oh, if you don't hear from us we're by such and such time, something happened. Okay. So this is why these people are already back home concerned because they already know what they went out there for. Okay. So that is John Dubois. Okay, so the next one they got coming up is the Dexter. So we're going to look into the Dexter next. Okay. So we got the Dexter. Well, we already know the story because he's connected. What was that? Oh. Okay, so everything is the same on his story, too. I'm just saying that it went out to California. Him and his friend is missing. Okay. So let's see what's going on with LaDexter Pelt. Okay, so there's some thoughts here about this trip. So he's um, he's thinking about this trip that he has to take, okay? So off the bat, he's concerned. Because we already seen Dubose spread. So off the bat, he's already concerned about what's going to happen on this trip. With this meeting so he's thinking about this meeting here um that he's going on see this he's thinking about it this path he's going down this trip he's taking So he's meeting up with this man, and then you have this female once again back involved in this situation. So we already know it's a male and a female involved between him, the Dexter, and John, okay? Because this meeting with this man that this female is involved in. Okay, so things are out of see. This female, she's the one running the show. So this female is the one who's handling all this. She's behind all this, this female, okay? She's the one behind this meeting. She's the one who helps set it up. What else is going on here? This child came out. So this child is innocent, I start a new beginning, okay, or an innocent person, new beginnings, a new start, okay. Here's once again, this female is a false person. So this female is not who they think she is. They think she maybe could be innocent, but she's not, okay. Okay, so now you have, see this meeting, him and his partner having this meeting where they're supposed to be exchanging some things, doing something for somebody, giving something to somebody in this meeting that they had him. This is him and um, John Dubose. Remember, this came out in John Dubose spread as well as his partner, as someone he was with, okay? But I think the female is connected to John. 
This female is somebody drawing you. So there's a message they have here. This is hot. So this means uh, like an, um, I'm trying to figure out how to say it. Like this is a message that uh, is of high concern, a big concern. So they got word here and now they're concerned or worried about this. Here. So I'm not sure if they were trying to send a message that they were a message out or this is the word getting out about some things. But this is a big man here. So this is a big time. Maybe this could be a big time drug dealer because obviously that's what it is going on here. So maybe this man here. See, wealthy man, high honor. This is a big man. So this could be somebody that's high up in the um, in the game. And see, so you have this despair with this thief. So we already got somebody was taking something. So they're in despair. Sorry about this card here. Okay. So somebody is not as innocent as they trying to seem or the, with the situation is not as innocent as we trying to put it out to be. What else is going on here? It's not just them going out on the trip just to have fun. And it's not this female is not as innocent as they try to make her out to be or whatever. Here you have this mature woman. Okay, so the female is the older female. She's feeling trapped in some type of way mentally or in the relationship or in the situation. What else? So this female here, this older female, somebody paid her to do something. Somebody gave her some money to do a job. To set this meeting up. Because see, she knew John. She was John's girlfriend or she was in a relationship with him and whatever, whatever the connection was with them, relationship, girlfriend, friends with benefits, whatever. But she, her job was to set this up. Okay. Because she was connected to John. She got work, gave him word. Okay. So that is LaDexter Pelt. All right. So now who's next? Diamond Bynum is next. Okay, so Diamond Bynum and her young nephew, King Walker, missing since July 25th, 2015, never returned. Family says Diamond has special needs and has mental capacity of a five-year-old. Um, okay, Gary, Indiana. Let me see what else they're talking about. Okay, so this is Diamond Bynum, but also, what's the baby name? King Walker. Now, I did one on them already. I didn't put it up. I didn't record it. But um, what I got in that one is that um, a female did this to them. She set up a situation for because, but let's see what we got. I'm not going to see what comes out here. Diamond Bynum, okay. And since it's King Walker, I'm gonna do them next and then him next. And um, that that'll be it for this this one here. Okay, so this is Diamond Bynum. Okay, what happened with Diamond Bynum situation here? Okay, we have a message of concern from the main female. 
can I just say a female? Okay, so we have this female worried about something. So this main female, whoever this female is, she's worried. She's concerned about some things. Okay. Why is she worried? Because she's a false person. Okay. She's a false person and she led. See, she's going down this path here. This journey. But this message of concern is false. She's not, she doesn't care. She's saying that she's, oh, I'm so upset. But she's not, okay? Because see, this, this concern is false. She doesn't care. And you know why? Because she led them down this path. She did it. Okay. And then that path that they went down was was like a false. So she's saying they went down the road. Lies. It's not true. So you got a message of concern. Okay, so somebody told somebody, call somebody, text somebody, whatever, saying that they were concerned about some things. So they told somebody, oh, I, I don't know. I'm just worried because they haven't showed back up yet. Okay. Uh-huh. So you have sudden wealth in this courthouse, okay? Legal. Because in their read prior, I, I got that this was kind of like for money, but not necessarily in a way of them receiving money, so to speak, or it could be just them not having to put out money. But then here you have some type of minor legal things here connected with something coming to you so this could have been for recognition this could have been for money this could have been for material things whatever but it was not necessarily for money per se but for like recognition of having things come to you what they call those women who do stuff to their kids to get um sympathy whatever they call those people Got okay, so what else is going on? So, you have this lover here in the expectation. So, you see the lover, so this female is connected with someone else, and um, I said it's the husband's di diamond's father's wife, that's who I think it is, okay. But see, you have this lovers, they're expecting someone. See, they're waiting, this lady looking out the window, waiting for somebody, waiting for this lover. She's expecting him to come. So I don't know if the father was at home or not. I'm not sure if he was doing, but she knew he was coming. Okay. So this is her expecting her lover to come, waiting for him to come home. But also her having an expectation, she's waiting, okay, waiting for him to come home or waiting for him to leave. Whatever it is, she's waiting. Too many cards. What else is going on? You have this message of concern and concern here. So this concern about the changes. So something was changing. There was a change of a situation, change of home, change of um, 
lifestyle change of something and somebody is worried about this change that they had to go through or that they're going through okay they're concerned about it they don't know if they want to deal with it or whatever see this child keep popping out so I guess they were concerned about the child the children They're worried about this death. Okay. This is trap. Now, when I did their read prior, yes, they may be deceased now, but I feel like she took them somewhere or had them somewhere confined somewhere and then went back later and did this. Or she did this, took them somewhere and did this, but had them, but she had them locked away somewhere, hidden off somewhere at I don't know where, but that's how I think it went. But see, you have this imprisonment, death. So she probably could have took them somewhere and left them there. But maybe couldn't make it back and they end up dying. Because they were trapped there, they couldn't get out. Because you see, this person is trapped, they can't get out. And then they died. Because she couldn't have carried them anyway. Okay. So you have this change of your obligations. Of things that you have to do. Now you don't have to worry about it no more. Because you didn't got rid of them. I don't think she wanted to get rid of the baby. I think she wanted to get rid of Diamond. You just happened to be there. But that was a good opportunity for her as well. They went off together. Okay, so anyway, so we have this change here. Of your obligations. But also connected to this death as well. This death caused some changes. Or, or because of a change of a situation led to the death. Because like I said, she could have took them somewhere and had them locked away. But they did this, and that was the change from the situation that she had, maybe she didn't plan on them dying. I'm not sure how what that was. But that was a good thing for her and her marriage. That was the best thing for her and her marriage. She don't have to worry about Diamond. That's what she may be feeling, okay? This older woman. She wanted to be looked at, like I said, she was, I don't know what they call that, where people do stuff so they can get sympathy with this older woman that's married, okay? So that is Diamond. Now I'm about to do uh, King Walker, and then I, that's it for today. Okay, King Walker. We already know the situation. It's connected to Diamond Diamond. Okay, so what's going on with King Walker? Great fortune here of concern, okay? So, somebody's concerned about their fate, concerned about his fate, okay? His well-being. This false person... It's the one that was in control, and we already know who the false person is, okay? This is the one who was controlling the situation or in charge of what happened to them or responsible for what happened to them.
this older woman is a false person okay this older woman has some things that she wanted some hopes dreams desires okay and um, also this is her going through a lot to get this done so she must have had to plan this so this older woman is a false person Once again, the lovers, a worry, okay? So, you have this older woman connected. Like I said, this is the father, her and the father. That's what I say. This is this older woman, which is the father's wife, okay? But this here, they're worried that things are not going well. So maybe things were not going well in their relationship, and maybe she related that to having Diamond around. Okay, so their relationship was not going well with her, this, this older woman. Sudden wealth. Okay, so things happening here. Once again here. So like this came out in Diamond Spread, same thing. This is you receiving something because of how people view you. So maybe you're receiving the sympathy and and all people, oh, let's go check on so-and-so, see how they're doing, you know, because you know they had this tragedy happen. So it's kind of like that type of situation. Maybe she thought it would bring her and him closer because things were not going well because they have to deal with this situation. And like I say, I don't think she intended for them to be, to die I think she just intended for them to be missing but in all of the chaos she couldn't get back to them without being watched I guess she didn't think of that part and they end up dying she had that card thought she's thinking about it okay Okay, so see, you have things not going well here in this situation. So, this is somebody in between two other people. Like I said, she thought Diamond was in between her and her husband. Okay, because this it could be the husband with her and Diamond. Like he's in between or Diamond between her and the husband. And causing things to not go well in their relationship. And she figured this, her being out the way, would help the relationship. Or the situation would help the relationship. See, I do care about Diamond. See, uh, how I was there for you during this time. You know, I don't know what people have going through their mind. But something like that. So this, like I said, this, this came out together again. She is the one controlling the situation. This was her work. Something she was doing. She wants the recognition. Okay. She wants to be recognized. female see like I said she didn't expect something this is unexpected income but this is something happened unexpectedly she did not expect things to go the way they went okay she did not expect things to go the way they went like I don't think she intended for them to to die all right final two two more cards bad health see like i said things between them were bad not going well okay and the situation between the three of them was not going well
this is some man and this is the pathway so this just means here this is the father maybe this is someone i don't know what the father's situation he has money not like saying that he's rich but um financially they were the path they were going down was not good because like i said it's not necessarily that they were getting money but it's how they had to spend their money maybe they were putting out a lot of money with diamond i'm not sure i don't know so their path here was not going well financially here there was some obligations that they had to do they don't want to do see this lady she sent them on a trip so like like she led them down this path like they were supposed to come back because you see they got the bag so they're going somewhere and coming back they're going coming back but see they didn't get to make it back because whatever what some whatever happened unexpectedly so that is diamond i mean uh not diamond but it's diamond buying them also but this is king walker relating to diamond walker as well and the situation surrounding them so tell me what you think in the comment section about these cases here